Listen to the sounds as they fill the air. Bonnie's magic brush will take us there. Oh dear Bonnie Bear, let's all play the listening game every day. Listen to the sounds as they fill the air. Pictures come alive. Can you see them there? Oh dear Bonnie Bear, let's all play the listening game every day. Listen to the sounds. Listen to the sounds and play. Bonnie Bear. Do you want to play the listening game? Mm-hmm. I do, I do. My magic paintbrush is ready, too. Okay, then. Let's play. <laughs> Did you hear that sound? Let's listen to it again. What could it be, Bonnie? That sounds like rain! That's right, Bonnie! Rain! <laughs> okay, now I'm going to play another sound for you. Burr! Ooh, did you hear that? Let's listen to it again. Burr. What could it be? I know. That's someone who is very cold saying brrrr. Burr. That's right, Burr. Bonnie. Someone very cold. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to play another sound. Get ready. Did you hear that sound? Let's listen to it again. So, what could it be? I know. That's a crackling fire in the fireplace. A fire in the fireplace. That's right. Bonnie, let's listen to the sounds again. Someone who is very cold. A fireplace. So, Bonnie, can you guess where you can hear those sounds? I can, I can. Whee! Those are sounds that you hear on a very cold winter day. That's right, Bonnie. A cold winter day. <laughs> Draw a crayon for us today. That's a great idea. Let's go to Bordy the board. To the board. <laughs> to the board. To the magical Bordy. One, two, three, four, five. Imagination comes alive. 
Hello, Fred and Fiona. What would you like me to draw today? I have an idea. Forty, can you draw a crayon? That's not a crayon. A crayon is smaller. That's an elephant. Well, that's not a crayon either. That's a cat. How do you know? Because a crayon is an object like a pen or a pencil, not an animal. Ooh, an object like a pencil, huh? I think we can get a crayon. Are you ready, Fred? I'm ready. One, One two, two, three, go! A crayon! Oh, oh what joy! Oh, what a sight! We were together and got it right! Whee! <laughs> Hey, Fiona, what's wrong? You look sad. This is a nice crayon. But what do we do with the crayon? Hmm, wait, I know. <laughs> <laughs> plant a crayon? <laughs> we don't plant crayons. Brush our teeth with a crayon. <laughs> That's not right. I think we can get it right this time. Are you ready? I'm ready. One, two, three, go! Oh, what joy! Oh, what a sight! We were together and got it right! Oh no, the crayon is gone. That's okay. Bordy can help us find the crayon again. First, we saw a crayon being planted in the ground. But that's not right. Then we saw someone brushing their teeth with a crayon. But that's not right either. <laughs> That's, That's funny! funny. <laughs> but then, we finally got it right. We use a crayon to draw and color pictures. Very good, Fiona! Thank you, Fred! Not too bad yourself! Goodbye, Fred and Fiona! See you next time! <laughs>
paper, crayons. I'm going to color. Hmm, I'm drawing. and their colors. Is that right? And now? This is right. The beet is purple, the green onion is green, and the pumpkin is orange. box of crayons. Crayons come in all colors. You draw pictures on paper with crayons. You color with crayons in a coloring book. We knew about crayons before, but now we know lots more. Call me Little Benny, I love to draw and paint. Museums are my second home and where my time is spent. I make my own creations, inspired by the art. So let's create together, cause that's the way to start. Let's create 